Lure Ziri today. Two hobby boxes, 23, 24 upright lure hockey, eight cards pack, eight packs of box. They didn't give a hobby box of lure. Should be expecting an autograph or 16 bit or doubloon. So we're not guaranteeing an autograph in each box. We'll get to that later. Five inserts, all of which look to be new. Eight colorful, so one per pack. Eight rookie cards, so one per pack. A total of eight black rainbow, red rainbow, or orange slice parallels. And two zero numbered or rare cards. And we're gonna hunt some chromium bedard. So there's that. But before we get into today's video, this video is sponsored by GP Sports Cards. Be sure to check out the release date breaks for 23, 24 Upper Deck Allure going down this Wednesday, July 24th. Featuring 9 box inner case and 18 box master case break options for Allure. Whether it's team select, hit select, or team random, be sure to check out the break options for 23, 24 Upper Deck Allure. Also, be sure to check out the pre national mega mixer going down this Wednesday, July 24th. Featuring 21, 22 the cup, some 21, 22 CDD black diamond, 12, 13 SP game news, and more. Also, be sure to check out Toll Sports Cards, the retail storefront for GP Sports cards located in Toronto, Ontario, which is now an Upper Deck authorized internet retailer. So be sure to check out TotalSports.com, check out the product they have available. So thank you GB for sponsoring today's video, all links in the description. Let's get into today's video. So 23-24 allure, before I get to on, these boxes cost 190 Canadian. Definitely a better artifact considering the past two years have gone down to like 65 bucks US, sub $100 Canadian. The product is definitely trying to find its footing. It's a 150 card base set with 50 rookies. Unfortunately, the 50 rookies seem fairly fleshed out. It has all the guys looking for. It has Connor Bedard, it has Leo Carlson, Adam Fantilli, Logan Cooley, Matthew Potro, so that's good on that front there. Plenty of parallels to the base. Not too many numbered parallels to the actual base. We'll get to the color flows in a bit, but the odds are different between the base and the base rookies. The odds pretty much double for the rookies. I'm super intrigued to see what this new hypnosis parallel is. I haven't seen it yet. One and two are for the base, one and four are for the rookies. For the numbered parallels, the constants would be the blue line of 35, the purple diamond of 10. Looks like gold glare bomb returns this year from last year, so, so keep that in mind. Also, color flow, one per pack. Combine five cards and it makes a rainbow. The number ones are spectrum out. The blue purple being the toughest of the 25. And for this year, for whatever reason there's a stanley cup card i probably should have put my like 1970 opt stanley cup card in the back but there's a stanley cup color flow one and two hundred packs and there's randomly an auto version that's like one of two thousand packs which is definitely a bizarre one there it's kind of a weird checklist as well and it's also worth pointing out the common inserts do have numbered parallels pretty high numbered parallels as well so some of those numbered cards you get are gonna be high numbered insert parallels so keep that in mind now let's go back to the box averages you're not guaranteed an autograph card in allure you're guaranteed an autograph or a doubloons or 16 bit the doubloons are one in 108 packs they debuted in 22-23 at 1 in 160 packs, so they got a buff there. It's still like 1 in 13 and a half boxes, but definitely got a buff there. And the noteworthy 16-bit card returns once again. Spider. Bruh. It debuted in 21-22 with unannounced odds. Super tough pull. And then 2022, they gave it stated odds. It was an announced card. It was 1 in 810 packs. And for this year, for 23-24 Allure, they buffed it once again to 1 in 576 packs. So still an extremely tough pull considering there's only 8 packs in a box. I actually have an 18-box master case of this I'm opening, so stay tuned for that. Still extremely tough. We're still highly likely to get autographs. The red rainbow and colorful autos are 1 in 32, so it could be one of those. The most desirable autographs would probably be like the purple diamond patch autos of 10. I actually pulled them recently. These are really nice and hand but that would be the target there two boxes 23 24 lure let's check it out here so yeah lure if platinum is tops chrome then this is panini select sticker auto central all sticker autographs probably should have pointed that out no on card autographs here I'm not huge on sticker autographs but this set definitely appeals to me more than a lot of sets pretty much only like series two and opg appeal to me more than this for 23 24 stuff that has come out to this point if this stuff came out after platinum we'd have no chance but since it's been a pretty quiet summer it looks like some of our key procs are going to come out in the fall or even next year this proc should stand a chance so first up here's the base so rainbowed out once again here refractored out like 22 23 design is decent there's so okay and i think that might be a doubloon so it's an autoless box and stutzla death jones is guaranteed no auto that's been a trend with upper deck you know near 200 a box no guaranteed hit just remember like five years ago 200 a box was a like high-end box but tory krug simone nemich rookie there so good to see a pretty decently fleshed out crop here so there's nemich the number two pick in 2022 defenseman for the devils logan cooley rookie so should be getting at least one rookie per pack i don't think that's a parallel there oh, here's our first color flow one per pack there interesting design there what is that orange yellow colorful there okay so is this a doubloon so this is revealed here no golden goalies and this is a black rainbow did not even notice that but golden goalies darts and camper so there's one of the common inserts bunch of parallels the inserts okay so yeah there's a black rainbow kind of tough to tell really tough to tell honestly you can hardly tell that coolie's not a parallel so keep that in mind very subtle this year very subtle in the black rainbow there almost can't tell but here we go pack number two barkoff marcia so brady kachuk Sebastian aho mason mctavish and another new insert conor bedard iced breakaway 
array. So another common insert, get five inserts per. So there's number pair of this. I'm pretty sure there's auto version of this as well. So there's a Bedard Iced Breakaway. Okay. And then we get White Johnson Color Flow Red Orange. Pretty common when they're red orange. And a rookie Yuri Patera. A product of Canucks organization. So okay. Probably missed a parallel because they're so subtle. But okay. Maybe not there. But let's continue on here. We get Alex New Hook, Kirill Kaprizov. So good to see some 2324 content here. Like you can tell that's from 2324 because New Hook only been on Habs in 2324. So let's continue on here. Trevor Zegris. And oh, we got something here. Jack Hughes. That orange slice. Might be orange slice. Yeah, orange slice Jack Hughes. So these are 1 in 12. So not guaranteed in a box. That is another question with Allure. What is going to be die cut? What is not going to be die cut? Because it seems like it's been all over the place over the years. Maybe there's no die cuts in here. But Jack Hughes, orange slice. Then we have a polished pros of... Mm -hmm. Any Kuznets off. Is he going to sign the KHL? I'm pretty sure he's still a free agent, right? He could sign to an NHL team still. Then we have a color flow of Mason Marshman and a Connor Bedard base rookie. So, dang. Okay. Just a base rookie there, but hopefully you get a nice parallel of him. I have 20 boxes this to open, so that's hope there, but base rookie Bedard. If I were to guess in the future, probably like a $20 card in like a couple weeks. Probably go for more of that within the next couple of days. I'm extremely slow to draw to sell stuff, so probably not going to jump on that, but Keller, Svechikov, Brent Burns, Roman Yossi, and Jack Eichel. Red Rainbow, so yeah, Red Rainbow you can tell that one there again i think the red rainbow should be numbered they're a nice looking card and we have a bar down of krill marchenko and that's a parallel there it's an orange the 399 glad it says that there bar down orange of 399 so not too huge on that honestly they can add more numbered parallels to the base and get rid of these i'd be fine with that but okay and then we have a color flow red orange connor mcdavid so that's good there and hey matthew patra rookie good to see him in here so okay so yeah some positives with his procs whoa is that a seismic gold looks like a seismic gold but i don't think it is mckinnon jared mccann i don't know what it is honestly dry set of Kopitar sets different looking see here black rainbow tristan jari not gold treasures it's a color flow oh it's a spectrum tyson forrester so orange yellow so what is that numbering it's a 199 there so orange yellow tyson forrester nice looking card there kind of overdoing it with a the pulsar there you see in like the size of the gold okay there's a brent burns color flow orange yellow and a nemich rookie again okay well the first nemich was like a black rainbow very hard to tell but let's continue on here yeah, there's connor mcdavid nice we got cole perfetti austin matthews it's good to see more 23 24 pictures got the all-star patch on the shoulder there so there's a jesper brat and chandler stevenson red rainbow with oh autograph uh. nikita nestorenko red rainbow autographs so these are the one in 32 autographs is nestorenko going to be the emile poirier jimmy schultz mikey anderson lisp is he going to be that guy we'll see who that guy is for 23 24 hasn't really emerged yet might be akito Hirose, but there you go nestorenko sticker autographs so yeah all sticker autographs in here so there's a hit sorokin color flow and a jonathan gruden rookie so okay two more packs of the first box got kyle connor travis konechny alex tuck matty Beneers. Uh, is that purple diamond or not? Kind of hard to tell. I don't think it is. Philip Grubauer, Black Rainbow, right? Yeah, Black Rainbow. Grubauer. And eight. Bedard number three already, so. Plenty of, unfortunately, cheaper Bedard rookies, I would say. At least they're new and fresh, but uh, the Kevin Korchinski is teammate rookie behind him there, so. And then that's not purple diamond. It's a color flow. It is Arbor Jack Eye color flow. It's at the tail end of the color flow there with the blue purple, so okay. And a file pack first box. Three Bedards, none of which are overly spectacular, but hey, three Bedards. So more base here. Quinn Hughes, Marner. You got Matisse Michelli, Rupe Hintz. I mean, our deck's still behind. We're in late July here, so we're still waiting on 22, 23 products. So there's Rupe Hintz. Is that a parallel there? I don't think it is, but okay. There's a Matt Coronado, Red Prism, or Red Rainbow Rookie there, okay. Polished Pros, Cam Atkinson, Color Flow of Andre Kuzmenko. So slightly out of date there, but understandable. Red Orange, and Sean Farrell. Rook. All right, that was the first box of the lure. Let's check out the second box of the lure. Largely mad box, even though we got three Bedards, including two rookie inserts. So check out the second box here. And yes, Bedard autos are quite plentiful in here. There's plenty in here. I mean, I want to get a nice Never parallel but out here that's the goal why i got a case so here we have here redacted there's koozie so some redactions there on power and then we got yuri slavkoski black rainbow by the way oh i should mention i'm still waiting on that seismic gold it's two months now black rainbow for slavkoski there there's a william dufour ice breakaways and also there's golden treasures the color flow i should have mentioned that there's a lot of golden treasures in this set kind of watering it down a bit but it's an orange yellow color flow and a matt savoy now on the edmonton oilers there okay okay next up here we got jason robertson the key Kucherov again like I have no idea what I'm looking at here it's probably a numbered parallel and like a red rainbow but it's definitely different this year I like to look at it this year there's Igor it's red rainbow nice I'll take it but we got a polished pros parallel so another numbered parallel it's gonna be a tough ass to get a numbered card to the base but 53 to 249 kind of disappointing they can't guarantee an autograph when there's a bunch of stickers but okay Jeremy Swayman color flow red orange and you got a Keto Rose base rookie this guy might be the Emil Pori of 23 24s okay let's continue on here okay there's Ovi Anton Lundell Tristan and 
Jerry, Philip Grubauer, Brandon Saad, Black Rainbow. Then we got Polish Pros, John Marino, now on the Utah hockey team. Then we got Color Flow, Tyson Forrester, Orange Yellow, and a Vincent Iorio rookie. Okay, pack number four, Mason McTavish, Chandler Stevenson, Jack Eichel. <laughs> And we got Matthew Patra, Black Rainbow rookie, his teammate there. And we have another goalie card, right? Yeah, Golden Goalies, Jeremy Swayman. That's a really gold card there to the point where it's like thinking it's something special there. But Golden Goalies, there you go, Jeremy Swayman. UC Cerro, Color Flow, Red Orange, and a Yona Kopanen rookie. Aggressively unspectacular box to this point. Hoping to get a better auto than Nikita Nestorenko. But see what we got here. It was Keller, Svechikov, Brent Burns, Roman Yossi. Connor Bedard, base rookie again. So Bedard is going to be plentiful in here. There's only 50 rookies. You get one rookie per, and there's a bunch of parallels. Hey, that's a Black Rainbow, actually, so that's actually quite nice. So, Black Rainbow rookie, but our decent one there. There's Arthur Kaliev. That's a numbered parallel there. Yeah, red 2799. Arthur Kaliev. Nice breakaway. I like that parallel. Nice looking parallel. I like that they didn't parallel out the entire card. It's just like the small part in the back. That's actually really nice looking. Cool. Kirill Marchenko color flow there. Orange yellow. And Evangelista rookie. So, yeah, good looking set this year. Now, granted, I wish they would simmer down a bit on the numbered parallels to the inserts, or at least guaranteed base numbered cards. But I'm liking the look of this set. There's Nuge, Austin Mercer, Matt Zuccarello, Zach. Hyman. Oh, geez. Is that a redemption? It is a redemption. Igor Shesterkin, Black Rainbow. Matias Michelli, Red Orange. Pretty sure Bedard's probably gonna be live. I hope he's live. Why is there redemptions for sticker autograph product? But okay. Matthew Kessel, rookie. Really? A redemption? Well, hopefully if it's a redemption, it's not some crap or maybe it's a decent name. I highly doubt it's gonna be Bedard. We'll see what it is though. A lower Red Rainbow, so it's pretty basic one there. No numbering. Number 47, Evan Bouchard. That's a weird one there. It's just a red rainbow autograph. Evan Bouchard expires in 2026. So, so yeah, Evan Bouchard, red rainbow auto. Not live. Very good offensive defenseman. Matias Ekholm is like the perfect compliment to him. But there you go. Evan Bouchard is our second autograph. Okay. Not a bad autograph. Wish he was live. Especially when it's a sticker. But let's finish off this box here. Charlie McAvoy. Good box. I mean, we got that parallel Bedard, Taylor Radish, Nazem Kadri, Kale McCarr, Logan Couture, Black Rainbow, Iced Breakaway, Adam Fantilli, and... And we have a color flow, Wyatt Johnston, blue, purple, and a Laferriere rookie. Bob pack, 23, 24 lure. Stay tuned for the case break. Interesting product. What is this? It would just be another red here, but we have Cole Gutman. Oh, yeah. I forgot about Luke Philp. But there goes Cole Gutman. Is that? That's a red rainbow. Cole Gutman. Jack Hughes, bar down. Mason Martian, color flow again. And a Leo Carlson rookie. So, yeah. So, yeah, guys, there's two hobby boxes. 23, 24 lure. So, yeah, interesting product there. You get a rookie per pack. Again, 23, 24 is a very strong crop. You get five inserts per box. Favorite would probably be the Iced Breakaway. Polish Pro seems pretty basic. And then you got the Golden Goalies there. And then you get all the color flows there, one per pack. We got a McDavid in there. So, of course, you got the non numbered parallels as well. We got one orange slice, a bunch of black rainbows, a bunch of red rainbows. So, so there's that. Our numbered cards, we did not get a single base numbered card. We did get one color flow spectrum and then some numbered inserts. Three different inserts there. So, we did get two autographs, including a Nestorenko Red Rainbow Auto and a Red Rainbow Vet Auto of Evan Bouchard. And we did get four Connor Bedard. We got two rookie inserts, ice breakaway, and bar down. We also got a broiler base and a black rainbow. So, all in all, fun break. There, you guys, stay tuned for more breaks to come. As always, thanks for watching. See you guys later.